So I've been thinking about something a lot more lately, and this is something that's not new to me, and it's been something that I've been passionate about for years now. For those of you that are new to the channel, I have done bodybuilding shows in the past. So my first show was in 2014, I competed in figure, and then my second show was 2015, and I competed in figure and physique. I actually started the YouTube channel where I started posting videos regularly after my first show, back in 2014, I believe. And then 2015 started posting more videos, fitness related, and then I documented my second prep, the entire prep on this channel. So if you guys are interested in that, but it's back there and the, the video quality is on point. <laughs> We're actually gonna sit down and talk with you guys more about this very soon. Long story short, Matt's doing a prep. <laughs> Muscles for days. <laughs> Hey yo, look at that. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. I am doing it. Oh. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> so what, what's your prep? What's your diet? Well, it's it's broken down by multiple weeks. So the first week's mostly sugar. So it's a lot of fruits and sugar. <laughs> and then the next week is like fats and carbs. Avocados and potato. That's it? And the rest cake. <laughs> <laughs> is this Mass Mindful Minute? No, this is not. <laughs> How to prep for a bodybuilding show. Yeah, I'm gonna show you how. <laughs> Maybe, we'll talk about it. We'll talk. Yeah, we'll, we'll discuss the rest of your diet in that. My diet starts tomorrow. <laughs> kitty, kitty, kitty. What you doing? Hi. because in our RV there are only so many places that we can have things, that we can store things, but yet I'm having the hardest time finding a microphone. I was gonna try out a microphone for our camera. If not, I'm gonna buy one because I know that the sound is kind of weird in here and if we film outside it's, it's kind of hard to hear. But I don't know where it is. I have a baggie that has things for the GoPro that we used to have before it broke. I don't know where it is. It's in the trailer somewhere, but seriously, how many places could we possibly have stuff? I don't know, I'm gonna find it. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Do you know where it is? Huh? Do you? Is that a yes? Where is it? Where is it? Can you help me? Okay, good. Let's go. Why is everything so wet? All the time, everything is wet. Wet and sticky? We talk what, what is you know this? what we're talking about. I don't know what we're talking about. We're talking about you. Me, me, me. It's all about you. Me. So now it's about me. because I broke my leg. <laughs> Basically, what we're going to tell you all about is the next 15 weeks. So she's done this twice before. She said that she wouldn't do it again, but here she is. She's uh, going to be a, are you going to do physique? I would like to do figure and physique again. Oh, we're doing two. Those bodybuilding, basically. Yes. Yes. So she, uh, we have the coach already. Uh, Done. So she's already working with the coach. Done. Uh, she already has the initiative to uh, kind of get on that plan. Uh, I'm excited. I'm focused. Diets and, and getting me in line and all that stuff. And so I'm able to walk right now. I'm able to help. Uh, not that really, you necessarily it's not need a lot. to help. Yeah, it's not a lot for me right now. But I don't know. I would say it's like I'm the wedding... What, what is it? Hold on. Whatever you're, you're having a wedding. Yeah, I'm like the coordinator. So it's like they don't have... They have a lot of like random jobs throughout the whole process but at the very end it's like you have a lot of jobs like you know I tell you to go over here I coordinate this person over here it's uh, I stand here and I, I shoot you with some air while you're drying with some tanning emotional and support and stuff. It's weird yeah a lot of emotional support it's I mean it's a wedding basically yeah it's, it's the show it's not as know? expensive as a wedding especially now that I, I still I have a suit yeah. and I have my shoes hey focus I'm gonna put him in the pen just on my side <laughs> yeah hey wait just go Go do it, go do it. Good jump! Three, two... Oh, um, okay. So... So yeah, basically, uh, yeah, she's getting started with all this bodybuilding stuff. We're gonna still try to do our trips, too, throughout the whole thing. And so we have a coach out of Massachusetts, apparently. Uh, we're gonna go to who knows where within that time frame. Probably we'll stay in Texas. Yeah, probably stay in Texas the whole time. We're gonna try to go, I think, to Waco Tanks. 
at one point. I don't know, I might get on some, some boulders. It's gonna have like a whole strict guideline of workouts. I'm gonna start getting in the gym more. Uh, so we're gonna go a little fitness on you. Yeah, and of course, if you guys ever, if y'all have any questions, because I know a lot of y'all are in this for the RV videos, but fitness and health, it's all encompassing. It applies to everybody. Of course, not bodybuilding and what I'm gonna be doing. That's a, more on the extreme side. Being aware of your food intake, aiming for more whole foods, like moving your body and exercising, it applies to everybody. So hopefully you guys can take away some positive things from this. And for anybody that's not new to the channel, y'all probably remember my previous prep. It went really well, to be honest. I think it was like six months after my show, I said I'm never gonna compete again. But that just kind of goes to show never say never. Because at this point, like, I'm really excited about this and I think it's going to be a really cool experience to do this again, knowing my body and how the first two went, learning from those and then carrying this forward into this next one. I think it's going to be the best one yet. And one of the other reasons why I wanted to do it is um, to do it as a vegan, like a full vegan prep because I went vegan two weeks before my last show, like I made the change overnight. I'm, I'm interested to see how my body responds to the different food sources and fuel sources that I'm now taking in. I'm at a really good starting point as far as metabolism and workouts and strength, so we'll see. If you guys do want updates on my prep as I go throughout the next 15 weeks, uh, make sure and comment below. Same with that. If you want just kind of, hello, if you want like general like i don't know just health tips and things like that also comment that below but oh, there's like the extreme over here but then there's also <laughs> me so normal healthy person <laughs> yeah so i'm gonna try to start uh, not cutting like i'm trying to get just kind of a, a little healthier. healthier yeah it's a little healthier so because I'm, I'm like a junk food vegan you know it's, uh, it's i'm still all burgers pizza and stuff like that so i'm gonna try to Which kind of rate that in some I'd like to kind of coordinate that a little bit better um, also with my climbing and things like that and so I know a lot of people with RV trips uh, they like to get out they like to travel they like to go hiking things like that uh, there's still a healthy lifestyle behind that and that's what I'm gonna be so uh, if you want to know more about that side <laughs> comment below Who knows? Uh, maybe I can start up my own little journey uh, because yeah I have a broken leg but at the same time I'm still trying to get my upper body stronger. Um, I'm, gonna start, so healthy. I'm gonna start doing some uh, fingerboard training because I like the climbing aspect. So hiking to a climbing spot, so. Calisthenics. Oh. I have calluses, right? Calisthenics. So that's what I'm gonna try to start getting into. <laughs> Not so much that side. We're looking to be able to do like six pull-ups in a row, you know? Uh, a little bit more than that, probably a little more than that. So that kind of stuff, just uh, general body weight exercises. Uh, something to keep you healthy, something to keep you moving, active. Yeah. Part of our lifestyle, it, obviously a big part of mine, it's my, my career, is fitness and health based. And then before we did the RV thing, bodybuilding was a lot of my, my lifestyle too. So I'm just kind of incorporating that all in. It's going to be interesting to see how that goes and how it differs I'm in an RV and with traveling as far as like workouts and nutrition goes. Yep, you will have to do uh, some some celebrity appearances at some other gyms, who knows? <laughs> so maybe like, I don't know, gold gyms or something Please small. Please don't anytime. say that, that's so weird. Oh, you're, you're weird. By the way, let me clarify, I'm a celebrity in this situation. <laughs> so I'll be showing up to these gyms and they'll be kind of like, you know. But that's gonna be happening here in the next, uh, hopefully a few weeks. We're hoping to even take a trip as soon as, what, two weeks out? Three weeks out? Like, something like that. So I'm actually walking with a cane now. That means I can get around, right? So let's do it. Let's go somewhere. Let's do it. Yeah. And operation prep, go! Thank yep. you guys for watching, and I look forward to this. <laughs> I look forward to all of this as well. I hope you look forward to it. Have fun out there.